Is the money going? That's the question for many in Atlanta. They are wondering how MARTA is spending sales tax money that it's been collecting for years for expansion and improvements. Now City Council has questions too. Council members are demanding an audit, but MARTA says that will bring improvements to a screeching halt. Our John Shearick is tracking the heated debate. Frustration among many riders of MARTA's rail and bus service. I don't think it's been improving quickly enough. Alicia Dorch and Kristen Turner of Atlanta wonder what's happening with the half penny sales tax that they've been paying for years. Money that's for the multi billion dollar more MARTA expansion plans. They say time for an audit. You know, you want to make sure that money's being handled correctly. So they say the Atlanta City Council has the right idea, calling for the city to audit the more MARTA project. We We've already spent hundreds of millions of dollars on more MARTA. We expect to spend billions of dollars. City Council President Doug Shipman. We're trying to do our duty to make sure that, frankly, the taxpayers are getting what they pay for. But MARTA says the council has not been paying attention and calling for another audit is disappointing and disingenuous. We have answered these questions in meeting after meeting, providing council members with frequent and detailed updates on the finances and the status of the expansion projects. Another audit? MARTA says such a review will obligate MARTA to pause work on most most of the more MARTA Atlanta projects that riders need now. This audit should not slow down the current work on projects that are underway. And council members Marcy Collier Overstreet and Amir Faroki say the information that MARTA has been giving the council has often been incomplete and incomprehensible. Voters and residents deserve full transparency on how the dollars have been spent to date. Uh, and how they'll be spent in the years ahead. But MARTA says the best thing the politicians on council can do for their constituents in the city of Atlanta is to get out of the way and let MARTA deliver the projects. The council says the mayor's office helped draft the legislation calling for an audit of MARTA. 11 Alive is working to reach the mayor to confirm if he will now approve it. In Atlanta, John Shearick, 11 Alive News.